idea. Uh, take me all the way in? No, no. No? <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right, Australia. <laughs> this is us. <laughs> oh, I can only just stand. Yep, got it. Australia. Right, <sighs> oh, <God. laughs> yeah. Says. Oh, my God. G'day guys, welcome back to another bloody episode. And you're probably wondering, Brody, what the hell have you got yourself into this time? Well, I got my bow, arrow, I got Strider Dog. The boys have literally just dropped me off on the tiniest sand island in the middle of nowhere. And we are going to do a solo survival for at least the next 24 hours. Let it go, Strider. Go on to the beach. <laughs> we made it. This is us. Oh, my God. Strider's just... <laughs> Sending it. No footprints on this island at all, apart from ours. Bloody starving already. So I'm just gonna start hunting. I don't know how long it'll take for me to get something with the old bow here. Ooh, get it. There's heaps of march flies around. March flies are these big overgrown fly wasp looking things that bite you. So it's not a great start at the moment. I bought no food, obviously. So the whole point is just eating whatever I catch or whatever I find. So I might go for a little explore out there, see if I can get something straight away. <sighs> I don't think I got anything. Try to some oysters. That one open. There you buddy go. Look at that. That'll do, huh? Oh, that one was good. Oh, I think I got it. That right there is a march fly. That's what's been biting me. And I tell you what, since you've been biting me. Tell you what, that's not too bad. I'm feeling that I'm up to swimming across in a minute. The tide should be slacking right now, and I think it's time to send it across that other island. Oh, <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. There's fins everywhere. There's actually dolphins everywhere in the channel. Come on, Strider, let's go. Good girl, huh? The most dangerous thing about what I'm doing right now is I'm barefoot. So I am keeping an eye on the ocean floor, but you really can't tell what you're gonna step on. So I'm trying to tread as light as I possibly can because stonefish, rays, all that good stuff. If I step on one of them out here, I am literally dead. Just stopping for a break. <sighs> Pretty much made it, Strata. The good news is I actually could walk the whole way. That sandbar literally runs across the whole thing. Oh, good girl, huh? Good girl, right? That was a good shot. Oh, I think I might have almost hit one then. There is a huge school of fish just here. I can see them all. Oh, oh, there's shark fins over there. There's actually shark fins over there. I do not want to step on that guy. You're good, bro. Oh, did you get one? Oh, that's a good buddy shot no one spooked him if i didn't where's my arrow this is my best chance so far of getting the fish there's a huge school right here there's a huge shark at my feet oh we're hunting buddies look 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 whoa 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 we on oh Oh my god. Big queen is coming. This big queen is coming through. Ooh, stuff going on everywhere. I got way too excited. Goddamn ADH just took over and I couldn't concentrate, especially when that shark rocked up. I'm gonna get my mind here, collect myself, and I am going to get a fish for dinner. I'm telling you guys right now. Go on! Yes! Mm. Yes! Woo! I bloody got one! Oh! <laughs> Strider! I got one! 
right between the eyes. Put him to sleep, no pain, no nothing. I've been trying for hours. Look what Dad's got. Oh, oh my God. Yes. <sighs> we did it, guys. We bloody got one. <laughs> I'm just walking along and there's a dead fish right here. And it's one that I've punched before and I didn't even know it. It's got an arrow straight through the middle of it. I can't believe I got two. I must have hit him before. Look at that. I'm going to leave my fish in the shade for an hour or two. The sun is actually on its way down, so it's only got maybe two, three hours left. So, Little John Robin Hood running through the forest. Ooh lally, ooh lally, gally, what a do. <laughs> Gonna start heading back to where I put those fish in that little shady spot. Get them. Make a little fire and uh, try and find the most comfortable, comfortable spot I can to sleep. I don't really know how that's going to turn out tonight. I'm most likely it's going to be in the dirt, which is all good, baby. Come on, Strata. All the boys have been here, there's footprints everywhere. I'd say they've gone. They've left me a little care package here, some water, but they've also left me a hoodie, which wasn't a part of the plan. This is a little GPS, EPIRBS, the GoPro in the water, but they've thrown in a hoodie. Oof. Hey, be careful not to spill any. Come on. Closer. Woo! Cheers, guys. Oh, ah, ah. So I've got an hour left of sun right now. That wind's starting to creep up and it was forecasted to absolutely pump tonight. So I'm gonna quickly get stuck into making a tiny little fire, have a feed before nightfall. I've done the whole island now already and there's nowhere great to sleep. I'm gonna go grab some sticks and do all that. Let's go. Ugh. A good sized bunch of tinder here, so I'm gonna take a little bit. I'm getting a little bit nervous about tonight because I don't have a cell phone, I don't have a head torch, and I'm completely by myself, which is basically the first time I've ever done this kind of survival mission. Normally I'll have a vehicle around so I know I can get home or I'll have my cell phone just in case. But this time, I mean, I've got a safety device and I, and I do have some sort of communication, but it's just different, you know? Come on, come on, yes, yes. This is the moment we've been waiting for. Oh, finally. Woo, we got fire, baby. Yes. The best thing about catching really small fish is the fire needs to be small and it doesn't take very long to cook them. Try put one of these big dogs on. <sighs> Whew. Well, it's a good feeling getting a little fire going, I can tell you that much. Just gonna get these guys going. I uh, taken the guts out of one, I gotta go take guts out of the other. And I'm just gonna put them straight on hot coals. Oh, save some for Strider. Ready to go. All right. A few coals there. Don't want it too hot. Look at that. Yibbida yibbida. Hew. Ooz. Oh! <laughs> you can literally hear them cooking in their own juices right there, guys. Ooh. One fish for Brody. One for Strider. Oh, this is pretty good. Look at that. Oh. Ooh. Huh? Is that good? I can't wait to try this. Mm. Oh. 
<laughs> Ooh, gonna have to excuse me guys I am absolutely going to decimate these little fish with strider of course because I'm starving feed with a view Basically the last of the light now, that sun is gone. Last of the fire too probably, they're my last sticks. Absolutely smashed that fish over there. Oh! This is it for now, this is me. I'm gonna chill here. The sun doesn't have too much left in it before it goes pitch black. Hoping for a little bit of a moon tonight. It's one thing that I didn't check, I don't know. Oh no, the moon's literally right above me. It's half a moon. Man, this is the kind of stuff that I just love, hey. I can't wipe the smile off my face. I'm a little bit nervous about tonight, which adds excitement to the whole thing. And you know when I get like this, I just have to thank you guys at home for watching because without you guys, I wouldn't be doing this. Get your merch, youngbloods.co. And uh, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Into the night we go. Yo ho. Can you guys see us? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Strider's here. Hello Strider, say hello. Well, it's pitch dark right now. I have no idea what time it is, but it's been a few hours. My eyes have adjusted now, so I can see shapes and stuff, and at least I can keep my eye on Strider, but she's such a good girl, she won't wander off. Um, I'm just sort of hugged up against this bush. So far, so good, guys. And I'll check back in with you in another couple of hours. Cheers. Hope you can see me. Well, I think it's been about an hour, maybe two. I'm guessing it's close to midnight right now. I can't really tell. And I'm still stoked. Still all good. <sighs> Man, it must be early, early hours in the morning now. Haven't had any sleep. Oh, Whew. there's the first of the light. Strider, how do you have so much energy still? There's nothing in there. Oh. Oh. You're crazy, dog. Oh man, it must be about, I don't know. Oh damn, I don't even know. 5.30, quarter to six right now. I'm hoping that the boys will be here in the next half an hour, hour. I told them to come pick me back up at first light because I didn't know how I was gonna go. Like, the night just gone. Cause I literally, I don't think we slept at all. Maybe got like an hour or two early this morning. Just, at, well I did, I just woke up. So at some point I passed out and I woke up to the first light. Yeah, it's good to have my buddy Strider here. How beautiful is that? Ah, oh, put you guys here. Oh yeah, I can hear them. I can hear them. <laughs> They're coming. They're bloody coming, Strider. Let's pack up and get the bloody hell out of this place. Real quick. There you go. Come on, Strider. Let's go. Go on. Let's get. Oh, big Barney's. Go on, Strider. 
How you going, fellas? Good. How's it going? Ah, uh, was a good experience. It's a little bit harder than what I thought. Yeah. Were you cold? <laughs> yeah, I was cold. If you guys didn't drop that jumper off, I don't know what would have happened. Yeah. It, says, it says 10 degrees. Yeah, I didn't sleep too much, but that's all good. Get me in that goddamn boat. <laughs> Mainland, baby. Did it. Lines are all the way out there. Oh, wishes that over yet, still a long way back home. <laughs> <laughs>